Good evening everybody, my name is Crystal, welcome to my YouTube channel. It is six minutes past five on a Friday afternoon. Just updating you to what's going on. Never argue with your stalker. Never, sorry Max, never, never argue with your stalker. Um, yesterday I blocked the stalker. I blocked, I blocked my stalker. Blocked them. Right, so I told the stalker, because the stalker was bragging. This, this James, who he said he was this time, was bragging. He was bragging. He was, he was like this and that and the other. And I want to meet you today. Right, now listen to this. He wanted to arrange to meet me today. And of course, I don't know this person. Right. So I said, no, I'm busy. I, 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 and um, we had a conversation last night. It got heated. There was a kind of an argument and I blocked this James. Right. So I told this James, I, I said, good for you. I've got parcels coming tomorrow. I'm fine. So we we've got we're having trouble with a uh, Amazon delivery. You've seen my small Christmas tree. It's two foot and pink. It's come from China. It's extremely tiny. Um, I love it. I'm going to keep it, but obviously it's not big enough to be a proper Christmas tree. Um, I was expecting it to be a bit wider. To be fair, I was expecting it to be that high, but I was expecting it to be a tiny bit wider for ten pounds nearly. So I've got to now go and buy another Christmas tree. So, delivered your Amazon.co.uk order. And it's got the number of the order. And it's telling me it's been delivered today. Charlie Pink Body Spray Fragrance 75 millilitres. Delivered today. There is no photograph of this parcel being delivered. There's no photograph. Your package has been posted through the letterbox and it's got Genestra on it. Not Jennifer. I don't know if I can see, I don't want to give all details, look. Hi Genestra, I don't know if that's coming out, but it says, hi Genestra. Not Jennifer, it says, hi Genestra. It's supposed to be delivered to my block of flats in Rochester. I don't know where it's gone, but it's not been delivered to my letterbox. Right, let's go back. Go back. Gold metal Christmas tree. What's that's your package has been posted through your letterbox. Hi Genestra. Return or replace items in your orders. Well, it's not in my letterbox. I've just been down there. I've opened it. There's not there's nothing in my letterbox at all. And you've got it, you've got to imagine there's about 10, 15 blocks of flats with all the same number. And you've got to rely on somebody's honesty. So if someone has put my parcel into their letterbox, you've got to be, you know, trust the person to return it. It does not show. They, they were mucking around with my Tesco's delivery the other day. Mucking about with it, thinking I was going to go outside looking for my shopping. And I'm not knock. I mean, I'm not telling you my door number, but um, 15 number, whatever number it is, down the road. I'm not going down the bloody road trying everybody's buzzer that's got my door number in Rochester. So... We've had the Christmas tree. You've seen that. So. Ch 
Charlie Pink Body Fragrance delivered today through my letterbox. Nothing in there. 50 LEDs, Pieces Candy Cane Christmas Tree Lights and my toothpaste. So my Candy Cane Christmas Tree Lights, they're not in them. They're to go on that little tree. They're not in my box. And my present for my mum, a bottle of perfume in the shape of a pair of lips. It's not in my letterbox. And when you go to I've just said it's my delivery is not so great. I haven't got my parcel. So they're supposed to be delivering another one. Track my package. I'm sorry, it's telling me on my on my in my email address that something's been delivered to my letterbox and it's not in there. Um, so I've gone on to the Amazon details and they've told me to wait twenty four hours. So my festive Christmas welcome doormat, they wouldn't be able to fit that into a letterbox. That would not go into a letterbox. It's a doormat, not unless it's a, to a toy doormat. I I'm after the size of the tray, I'm now worried that the doormat, if it's small enough to fit into a letterbox, So, 12, 12 pieces of candy cane Christmas tree lights. Um, bottle of perfume that's for my mother and not for myself for Christmas. And a doormat. And a Charlie Pink fragrance. All supposed to be delivered into my post box, which isn't big enough to, to have all that in it. It's not there. That either means the driver hasn't delivered it, it's gone into someone else's box or someone's pinched it. So I've been advised to wait till, well, I'll have to wait till Monday, won't I? I am not going down the whole street pressing everybody's buzzer. No, I'm not. So you chat to somebody and you get punished because you block somebody that's being a pervert and is demanding photographs uh, and I just, I don't know what's going on at all. It's, it's, I'm being punished for not uh, giving this guy photographs, am I? This person. They shouldn't be allowed to fiddle with my stuff like they're doing. They shouldn't be allowed to do that. Right, so I'll replace it. I'll get my mum another present. But all the stuff they've stolen or what they've done with it is going to get replaced. And I'll never, if I don't get my fucking stuff, I will never shop from Amazon again. Never. I will not comply, I will not do as I'm told, and I, they will not get any photographs, whatever they fucking do, basically. Um, if, you, if someone has pinched it, I hope they enjoy what they've stolen. conclusions we ain't gonna jump to conclusions because you know that's gonna get me stressed out now you know it could be genuinely in the wrong of black block of flats in the wrong box but I failed to see how they fit a doormat 
a bottle of perfume, a body spray and some tree lights all into a tiny mailbox. Because that's what it says. <laughs> All you can do right is wait the 24 hours and obviously after my cat's gone missing I'm gonna have a black look out outlook on it aren't I my cat's been stolen I'm telling you now if they keep stealing my stuff I'm not letting that lie They'll, I'll have to ring the police of course I will I think I'm gonna sit in here with my mouth shut and they keep nicking my stuff. No way. So I'm in my flat on my own. Don't have any kids or anybody with me. There's Max and I'm keeping my eyes on him. Um, somebody's asked for my bank card details. I'm not giving it to them. Never give your bank details over the phone to anybody because somebody there could be spyware. Somebody asked me for my bank details this afternoon. And then, you know, a few days later, I, I'll find my fucking bank fleeced of all my money. So I'm not giving anybody my bank details. I'm not going to say any more about it. I think it's a genuine mistake. But you, you, if someone's stolen it, they've got my mother's Christmas present. I'll see you later.